right, guys, I'm going to show you how to connect the Mitsubishi iMeve via an OBD link to the Canyon app. All right, so because the OBD link LX has a very short handshaking window, you have to plug it in, turn the car on, and hit connect as soon as you can. So, here we go. I'm gonna plug in the dongle, turn the car on, start up the app. And there it goes. If you don't do it that quickly, then it may not connect. All right, it's pretty simple. And then you can move back and forth between the different screens here by sliding, or you can tap on the menu and go through each of them. I think the battery status is one of the most important. The uh, battery temp, oops, battery temp is also important. Um, amp hour history, let's see. What else is important here? State of charge, history. Um, yeah, so in about you can figure out, uh, let's see, what is it? Yeah, I recommend it. Nah. So I want to go to settings. And then Bluetooth dongle. You can choose USB or Wi-Fi here. I'm using the Bluetooth for this one. And by the way, if you go to... easier to use the menu because sometimes if you go to trip viewer you get stuck in here and the slide won't work back and forth I haven't figured out how to how to get it to go oh there we go I guess you get a swipe from this edge yeah so it's easier to use the menu to move between the screens if you get stuck on <clears throat> on a screen so far I'm only getting stuck on the trip viewer screen so they're not updating this app anymore so uh, it is what it is but what's nice is that it has the battery it's got the volts history but it's got the battery um, status that's an important one so we know where the voltage is on each cell, what the difference is, average volts and the difference. This is important. And then of course the battery temp. These are the two important screens to me in history. All right, anyway, that's how you connect and use Canyon. Thanks, hope that helps someone. Just make sure you start, you plug in the dongle, start the engine, start the app, do it quickly. Otherwise, you may miss the handshake window. Hope that helps. Good luck.